happy Sunday fun day you guys this is Laura and I'm back again with another video all right you guys so what I have here is the chalk I didn't sift it I didn't do anything with it I basically just have it in the in its rare form from me after crumbling it so there are still some hard crumbles in here I do have paint in here and glitter and all types of stuff of that matter. But today I'm going to be reforming this. <laughs> Thank you guys for the tips. Uh, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and that you enjoy this video. Okay. So what I have here is a bucket. I guess a little plastic bucket. And I have some trays. But you guys, as you can see, it's very sunny. Got a sunny day. A sunny, sunny Sunday. All right, clear, a clear sky. So I have these trays lined up and I have these kind of an oval shape, kind of like a small rectangular shape. And then I have some smaller ones here. And I also have a little stirring method. I have water, okay. And I have, yeah, this is filled with water and this is water. And I also have some little molds here of the little seashells. So I will be putting all of the contents inside of this and stirring it. So let's see how this goes. All right. I will be getting like big pieces out of this like if I feel some or if I see some like this I'll be taking that and putting it to the side you know just be kind of sifting my way through you guys I am working with one hand today one hand Get it all in there. My bag closing up on me. But I'm gonna get it in here. I guess that may be enough for these little dishes, little rectangles and these large ovals. We gonna put a little bit more in there. I'd rather have too much than too little. Okay. No more. Just to be on the safe side. Okay. Let me up a little bit. Okay. So, see this? Definitely taking that out. Any little like heavy things that I'm filling in here. Thick. Yes, we're gonna take that out.
I'm gonna need way more water than this. Okay, you guys, I'm going to use the bigger bucket one second. Literally one second. I ended up having this full, but it was too heavy for me to pick up with both hands and having a phone at the same time. So this was full. I just poured out the end of it for you guys. So you can see. So hopefully I didn't use too much. Oh yeah, this seems really watery. Look at those colors. Now my idea reforms is gonna be beautiful. Kind of like a speckle. See the color in them? In it? Look at that. But I'm definitely sure I use too much water. So I'll be adding more of the contents. Let's get a little dirty here. Let's get a little dirty. Put that over there. Now I can actually feel what I'm doing. the sides of the bottom. So see how these balls just kind of form in the water and so I'm pretty much getting all the lumps out. Okay, you guys, so I got it all mixed up. But as you can see, it is super watery. This is not even thick as pancake mix. <laughs> but it smells wonderful. It smells just like chalk, wet chalk. And it's made a beautiful color with all the speckles. See that color? It's pink and yellow, blue all the different colors so i'm thinking that this is going to be beautiful um what i am going to do is i'm going to add more mix but i have mixed and mixed and mixed so it's got this type of consistency yes guys i had to get my hands dirty but it's okay okay so i'm back here again getting more get the big paint out of there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to mix as I go for a thick consistency. As you know, I am experimenting. <laughs> I don't know. What it's going to actually come out like, but I have an idea. You can see it's like milky, yeah, thicky, like thicker. a shake. Kind of thin, so but very more. thick in texture. That's what you're going for. I'm going to add two of this. Two. Oh, the bag is going down. Let me catch it. Hold up. 
too. So let's see. Oh, I just formed a sheet right over it. Like. That's what I'm looking for. type lumps but I think I'm gonna go for it I think this is where it was I watched some other reforming pages and it looked like it was about at this state
Set that one there. you guys so I'm going to my second one for one of these smaller square shapes and I'm gonna probably put it in here thinner of it because it's so big it may take longer to dry but this sun 
I got faith that this sun is going to be drying them all. So, let me get all of that. See if I can wipe it off a little bit. Wipe that off a little bit. We're low now on this, so here we go. Let me see if I can just, oh, that's too much to pour. It's too heavy. So, keep on. Those are my little spatula. For my last one this one is gonna go here <laughs> all right So what I'm going to do now is set that there away from the table. Look at all that paint. This is in there. This is gonna work, but it's moving slow. I think I should just pour it all on top of it because I'm not gonna be able to do it neatly because the bucket is so big. And then get all of that. And just scoop off the top. It's messy.
walk around, make sure it's in the malls. And, I don't know. Get this off of here like this. I can feel the chalk hardening up on my hands right now. Can you see that? So it's definitely gonna dry. I don't know how this is gonna turn out. This is just an experiment, but I'm done. So I'll be letting it sit in the sun. Thank you guys for watching. Let's come back and see if we've reformed some chalk.